This has been baseball through Wait Hoyt's memories and certainly his own tribute to baseball. His convictions here expressed tell his love of the game. The fellow said to me, the last year it was, he said, uh, I wonder what they will say 300 years from now. I said, what do you mean? He said, how will they describe baseball then? They'll, they'll be talking about the game that used to be. I said, what do you mean the game that used to be? Well, he says it wasn't in existence 300 years ago, and there's no reason to believe that it will be in existence 300 years from now. Well, that's a little far-fetched, and that's that's perverse thinking in a way, but it could be. Maybe some of these games like baseball and football will be replaced by others, but this has been a grand game, and it's served a lot of purposes, a lot of people, a lot of youth, and a lot of ulsters. And uh, it's a game to be thought of in, in, they say, national pastime, and occasionally people in other sports question whether this is the national pastime. And with no effort to deprecate any other sport in the world... Uh, uh, because they're all fine sports, and I'm really a sports lover of all types. Love football, basketball, hockey, and it may be that uh, a fellow gets a little too old to take them all in, but on the other hand, they, they're all great. But this has been a game that has had seen very little change in some respects, and through the years has, has done a lot for a lot of people, both on the field and spectators. All right, they're putting Dotter out on first base, and we go on with the game. Now, this is the top of the seventh inning. We are 